And tonight, the Golden State is one step closer to going fully green. The state Senate just passed a bill that puts the state on track to become 100% reliant on renewable energy by 2045. But is that even possible? CBS 13's Lamore Abrams is at an Elk Grove solar farm getting answers. Well, energy experts tell us it'll be expensive, but it is possible for California to rely only on renewable energy by mid-century. The question is how? Many are looking to solar farms like this one, but the problem is it may not be enough. Jump! Oh! Colleen Adams still picks figs with her granddaughter out back, but steps from the orchard behind those tall gates, her great-grandfather's 150-year-old Sacramento dairy farm is now a solar farm with enough energy to power thousands of homes. When we were cows and crops and solar was not something we knew anything about. Adams still has the original deed for the land that was signed by Abraham Lincoln, but decades later her family would make a deal with a major energy company, 115 acres of pasture land for rows of solar panels. Uh, it's the future. The future for the Golden State looks greener than ever. We believe that the future right now is wind, solar. Senator De Leon is pushing a measure that would require all California power to come from alternative energy sources such as solar, wind, and hydro by 2045. The legislation passed in the Senate, but can it pass the consumer test? Anything's possible if we are willing to incur the cost to get us there. UC Davis economist James Bushnell studies the state's energy consumption. He says a total reliance on renewables is feasible with new technologies. Batteries would either become a lot cheaper uh, and raise their capacity so that they can store up enough energy to take us through, say, the nighttime. But he says those breakthroughs will cost us. I think one of the issues is whether it's a good idea to go 100 percent. If it turns out that getting to 100 percent doubles our costs, say, relative to 90 percent. Technology, I'm personally behind. <laughs> Adams may not know much about the energy grid. She just hopes her granddaughter follows in her footsteps to reduce the carbon footprint. For now, the 100% renewable California bill heads to the assembly. All right, Lamar, thank you very much for that report tonight. Develop